Hey everybody, it's Andrew from Honeycart, and in this video, I'm going to show you a new feature we have for uh, the work orders for your orders, where now you can divide all the items in an order by different kitchen prep stations. Um, and this suggestion came uh, after um, one of our customers said that the way they like to divide up their workflow is um, basically they have different different teams uh, that handle each part of the order, uh, you know, they divide the kitchen into different prep stations. And what they prefer to do is for every order that comes in, for example, um, like this one here, I have a, like a dessert item, I have an appetizer item, I have an entree item. Like each of the each of those items are gonna go to a separate uh, kitchen prep station. And um, instead of giving them one long list with all the stuff combined, they just wanna have one list of stuff go to each station so that they only got to worry about what they have to prepare and so i'm going to show you what that report looks like what those work orders look like first and then i'll show you how to set it up so um you're going to find those work orders under the same places that our current work orders are like you can preview it or you can download it so for this i'm just going to preview it but if you wanted to you could download a pdf and it's the exact same thing so uh i'll just download it right now so Okay, so here is the PDF that just printed out. You can see that those cinnamon rolls are sent to the bakery. And I have one prep station that handles both entrees and sides. So here you see uh, the wings. And then if you do have an item here that is not assigned to a kitchen prep station or you forgot, like it'll just print out an extra work order just for those items. It just says no station on it. But um, so now I'll show you how to set that up, how to set all this stuff up. So it all starts from the menu. You wanna go to your menus and you can see here, if I were to go to the cinnamon rolls and now you scroll down under the advanced settings, you're gonna see there's a new section here for kitchen prep stations. So just go ahead and um, choose whichever one is relevant. I'm gonna leave mine at bakery and then I'm just gonna press save, right? Um, but let's say I wanted to assign all these items to the entrees prep station. Uh, you don't have to go and do one of them one at a time. You can select them all here and go to edit, go to kitchen prep stations and then choose entrees and sides. Make sure you check this box that says that it's going to set it to entrees and sides for all these guys that I selected. So click save. Now when you go in here, you're going to see that it is set to entrees and sides. Uh, so we also let you define those kitchen prep stations if you go under your settings and then you go under store settings and then you'll see like the kitchen prep stations is right here. Click on that. Um, you can see here that I've created some test ones that I've archived that just is kind of like a recycling bin where it's not going to, you know, it's not going to show up as active, but um, it's kind of sort of like deleting, but uh, whatever. So here, if you need to add a new one, you can type one in that says, um, I don't know, French fries, whatever, right? Fry station. Sorry, I'm... I'm not actually, I've never worked in the kitchen, so I don't know what these stations would be, but that's just a, um, an example. So uh, once you do that, it's gonna show up in the list where, you know, in the menu item when you need to set it. So that's about it. If you have any questions, please let us know at support at gethoneycart.com. Thanks.